tonight, the reopening of Yosemite National Park has been pushed back. Officials say it will not reopen until next Friday, August 3rd. Crews are making some progress on the Ferguson fire, but it is still just 29% contained after burning 46,000 acres. And this is just one of several large fires burning tonight in California. KC24's AJ Cotto live in Corskoll. And AJ, will the fight to put out all of those other fires impact the resources for the Ferguson fire? Well, yeah, that is a question on a lot of people's minds right now. The car fire and the Cranston fire both burning very quickly through California. But I'm told by Cal Fire here tonight that all of the resources currently on this fire are staying put. This smoke plume, a fixture on the horizon for two weeks now. The Ferguson fire now nearly 46,000 acres and 29% contained. We're here for the long haul. But no one knows just how long that will be. Evacuees like Angelina Alvario are feeling the uncertainty. Just crazy, like I don't know what's happening and I don't really know where the fire's at, how big it is, or if it's going to burn down my house. She and her family are staying in a hotel, eating meals at a shelter set up at the Mariposa elementary school, housing about 30 people and nearly 60 animals. The workers hoping to offer some comfort. They're happy and excited to, it's kind of a semblance of normalcy that you, you normal lunch, dinner, meals, and but there's still a normal not normality going on in an abnormal situation. Wind from the north is helping slow the spread of fire towards Yosemite, but also pushes it south, where embers jumped containment lines. So we're really focused on this end right now with a combined effort aerial attack and the, the ground crews are getting in there. Crews take it day by day as conditions change and evacuees do the same. I think it helps a lot. We got a huge family out here. We all got evacuated. So we're here helping each other out, supporting each other. And you can find a current list of evacuation zones as well as information on the shelter on our website. It's yourcentralvalley.com. Live in Course Gold, AJ Cotto, KC24, Local News That Matters.